a, uh, a say quarter a third hand sized uh, plate of quartz crystals uh, sitting on a matrix crystallization taking place on the back part as well so here here we have some tiny quartzes associated with feldspar other associations from this deposit um, which would be in the in the proximity of Good House in the Northern Cape of South Africa, or generally Orange River region. Orange River region runs for, for over 2,000 kilometers. Um, and the section we usually talk of is the, the one between, which intersects between Namibia and South Africa, the Orange River there, uh, where these quartzes come from. But in this case, the, the, the town in the closest proximity would be the little town of Good House. Now what we have here is predominantly clear quartzes with little dusting of hematite inside them. Quite a lustrous little guy. Um, when we take it on a cross section, projection, one or two project quite nicely. Um, let's zoom in there, get some focus on the matter. And when we look into these crystals, let's see what we see. Lots of phantoms, little phantoms of perhaps kaolin clay or, or quartz crystals at the time, which were um, second quartz flow came over. Here's a nice concentration of uh, hematite, little hematite flakes, uh, gray to red, trapped inside the quartzes. So from a display point of view, um, you could have it on a turntable going like that. Or you could have it standing flat. I would actually have it standing flat, maybe at a slight angle. So we have it going around like this. All the way from South Africa, Orange River Quartz. Lightly, lightly ferruginous. So a touch of, touch of hematite inclusion.